when it has it, and with the best shot girls, happy Juma Day! And today we're going to be reading another one of our stories from the Kids Quran, chapter 15, the Prophet Abraham Skepsis. Let's get started. The Prophet Abraham was a great prophet. He lived a long, long time ago in the land of Palestine. The Prophet Abraham wanted all people to know about Allah. He pre preached the message of the one God and told people to pray to Allah and thank Him for everything they had. People did not want to listen to the Prophet Abraham. They turned their backs and went away. Only the Prophet Abraham's wife and his nephew Lot listened to him. One day, some men came to the village. They stopped at the door of the Prophet Abraham's house and said, Peace, peace. The Prophet Abraham greeted them. Also, they, peace be with you. The Prophet Abraham thought that they were strangers from another village. He rushed inside the house. He brought food for them. The men did not touch anything. They did not eat the food because they were not human. They were really angels sent by Allah. Devil, a cat and some food. It looks like those are like fish or maybe bread and then these look like juicy apples. The prophet Abraham became afraid but the angel said don't be afraid. We have brought you good news. You will have a son. He will be very wise when he grows up. The prophet Abraham's wife was very old. She did not believe in what the angel said. She said, I'm too old to have a baby. I yes, it's your turn. The angel replied, this what Allah wants. Allah knows what's best. What you want to Thank you, Yasmin. The prophet Abraham asked the angels, why did you come? Do you have more work here? The angels replied, Allah sent us to punish wicked people. They live in the cities of Sun and Gomorrah. We are going there. The prophet Abraham's nephew, the the prophet Abraham's nephew, the prophet Lot, also lived in one of the cities. The people of the the cities were really very wicked. Only the prophet Lot and some of his family were good. The angel said to the prophet Lot, "Run away at night and take your people with you as." As Allah told us to destroy the wicked cities, the night came. Suddenly the towns were turned upside down. It also began to rain, but it was not raining water. It was hot fire falling from the sky. All the wicked people died and nothing was left of the city. These, This is... How the angels sent by Allah destroyed the wicked people. Only the peop the good people were saved. These are the ruined cities. If you like that story, then join it for join it for next week for chapter sixteen, building the Kaaba. We want to get to a hundred likes. So can you do that? Let's do it, okay? Subscribe if any questions. Um, go to our Facebook page and leave all your comments there and check out some of our new things on Facebook. And tune in for next week for the next chapter. <laughs> bye, bye guys. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum.
Thank you.